Hey guys, it's Yuvraj from the Brainstorm Force team. And today, I'm excited to tell you all about the latest updates to our flagship product, Astra. Introducing Astra 3.1. With Astra 3.0, we made a giant leap by releasing the amazing header and footer builder, which made it accessible for anyone to create beautiful headers and footers without any code. With Astra 3.1, we're pushing the envelope further. We're introducing some brand new features in the header and footer builder and we're also announcing other major improvements. Let's talk about them, starting with the new features in the header and footer builder. The first new feature that we are introducing is the clone feature. With this new feature, now you can clone elements inside the header and footer builder. The process is pretty simple too. Just hover over the element that you want to clone and click the clone button that appears on the element. It's that easy. Cloning is different from adding the same element to the header or footer. When you clone an element, you also copy all the setting changes that you've made to that element, which saves you time in making those changes again. The second new feature in the header and footer builder is deleting elements. Removing elements from the header and footer builder was already possible by clicking the X icon on the element. But the delete feature is a bit different. When you delete an element using the trash icon, it is completely removed from the customizer memory, improving your website's performance. The next feature that we've added in this update is a brand new language switcher element. We noticed that the current process of adding a language switching option to websites was quite inefficient and often required making changes to the theme code. With the new language switcher element, all that goes away. Now, you can quickly add multiple languages to your navigation and let Astra handle the rest. The language switcher element is fully compatible with the WPML plugin. If the WPML plugin is installed on your website, just add the language switcher element to the section of the menu where you'd like to see the translation options. You'll notice that Astra has detected the presence of the WPML plugin on the website and will also automatically add all the languages added in the plugin to the section of the menu you configured the element on. Working with other translation plugins isn't difficult either. Just use the custom option in the element settings Add the languages you'd like to add. Then add the respective URL for the translated version of your website. It's that easy. Now let's talk about all the improvements that we've made to the cart element. If you have WooCommerce installed on your website, you should already see the cart element in the header and footer builder. We've added a new flyout option in the cart element, which quickly lets your customers see what products they've added to their carts. It works great on desktops, tablets, and even mobile devices. So, no matter what device your customers are shopping from, they'll have a great shopping experience. The button element has some usability improvements as well. We've made it easy to change button sizes by including easy to use size options in a drop-down menu. This makes it easy to change button sizes and also keep button sizes consistent throughout your website. We've also improved the search element and added some additional options. Now you'll be able to not only change the icon color, but also the placeholder color, background hover color, search box height, and many other options. Now let's talk about all the amazing improvements we made in the customizer in Astra 3.1. Let me show you some specific examples. In the customizer in Astra 3.1, we've improved the color picker experience significantly. It looks better, makes it easy to see and change the colors, and overall makes your life easier. In the properties that support it, you'll also be able to see the regular color and the hover color side by side. Here's a before and after comparison of the old color controls and the new color controls. The second customized improvement is in the blog meta options. Again, we've improved the user interface to make it easier to make any changes to the blog meta. We've also improved the design language to keep it consistent with the rest of the customizer. Here's a before and after comparison of the old blog meta structure and the new blog meta structure. The third change we made in the customizer is with regards to checkboxes for different settings. We've replaced checkboxes with toggle switches where they make sense, which offers a clearer picture of the options that you're looking to change. Again, here's a comparison of the old checkboxes with the new toggle switches. The fourth change that we made is similar to the third one. 
we've removed the drop down options in many places inside the customizer and replaced them with tabs. This way you can see all the options presented at once which provides a clear and concise view of the settings. All the changes in the new version of the customizer are designed to reduce the number of clicks and amount of scrolling you have to do while navigating, customizing or changing any of the settings making the entire design process faster and more efficient. With all these new features and improvements, Astra is better than ever. We're constantly improving Astra, adding new features, improving old ones while maximizing performance. In fact, we've already started working on Astra 3.2, which will have even more new features. Which features do you think they'll be? Let me know in the comments. Talking about Astra 3.1 again, I'm really excited for this update. And looking at all the features and improvements we've made, I hope you are too. So, don't wait, download Astra or update it to the latest version today. Before you go, make sure you're subscribed to our channel so you can receive these amazing updates regularly. Astra, the choice of more than a million people.